1, 4. I always thank God for you because of his grace given you in Christ Jesus. So, Lord, we thank you for your churches in Austin, and thank you for the grace that you've given them and what you're doing in each church all across the city and how you are just building us together as one. Um, so let's go over to our church prayer board and I'll pray uh, for the church. Let's all pray at the same time. Stop. Stop. I feel that beautiful and would rise up from that place like just incense, just worship, prayer, song, the meditation, so honor, honor, study, study would rise up from David Chapel in East Austin before you were thrown into the whipping tree. They would know that they are known to walk in the fullness of the last day of the Um, Father, I want to thank you for Shoreline. I want to lift up uh, Rob and Laura to you, pastors there, in the midst of even time of, uh, time of grieving in their life as a family, that you, God, would be at work in their hearts, letting them know how much you love them, how great your destiny is for them and for Shoreline. Father, I thank you for John Burke and Gateway mm. Church. I thank you for the grace that you've given them. I share with them the depth of your love and your kindness, God. Well, I pray for Krista Ray. Thank you for them and the heart that you've given them for the poor and the needy. Mm -hmm. And um, thank you for Father Jamie and Sister Guadalupe. Zion, for Pastor Galen Clark. I just ask that you would put your peace on that house, God, on that congregation. I just ask for your protection. Right now, just in yeah. thanksgiving and pray that the graces you've given them for truth, for justice, you would rise up from that place like incense, worship, prayer, song, meditation, honor.